Hey guys, we have here our Microsoft Surface tablet and in this video we want to explain to you how to perform a factory reset on one of these devices. So start out by pressing here on the magnifying glass on the bottom of the screen and then here in this pop-up we're going to see settings. So the settings app. In case you don't see that then you can type this here in the search bar, just type in settings, but here in case it's already there on those top apps then you just click on that. Now here in the next screen we're going to take a look at the left side and there you see systems. So we're going to click on systems and then on the right side we're going to see this little drop down menu here, this menu is that we can scroll and we're going to scroll pretty much down to recovery and here we're going to see a couple of options. The first option is here reset this PC and this is what we want to select. So this is going to give us the option to factory reset everything and we can do this by uh, either keeping our personal files and just removing all the apps and settings or by really literally removing everything. So that's what we want to do here today. So we click on that and then here it's just going to confirm that this is really what we want to do. So it tells us again what will happen if we are going to press next. So let's do that. And now we have to actually connect it to power while we're going to running through a bit, uh, full reset. So we're going to plug this in here and then it's not going to change it automatically. We have to press back and then press next again. And then the factory reset is going to start. And that says this won't take long. And that's true for the first step. So uh, now it's going to give us a couple more information of what's going to uh, happen if we uh, press the reset button. So we want to actually do this. So let's press reset. And now it's going to actually take a long time. Uh, to perform this factory reset. So the first step is taking probably around 15 minutes. So I'm going to cut this completely out and then the tablet is going to restart and then this blue screen is eventually going to show up. Uh, so now it's starting to install some stuff. And once we do that, then it's also going to reset a couple of times. And then it's going through this installation process and this also takes several minutes. So um, during this time you just step away, do something else and let it do its thing. So now after we see this blue screen, then it's eventually uh, going to reset again once it's reaching 100%. So it will restart by itself. Do you see the Windows logo? Then you're going to see this uh, blue circle here or the circle that slowly increases here, fulfills and once this is completely full, then the uh, tablet is just going to power off. So it's just going to sit there. And then at this point, we actually have to press the power button. So in order to continue the factory reset or to the new installation, so we press the power button and then you see the blue screen again where it's continuing the installation. And then eventually we see the familiar just a moment for the real startup of Windows. So and now it's going to go into the uh, welcome screen as if we just uh, bought this tablet. So of course it's not bringing so blurry, it's going to be crystal clear and then we can go through the setup wizard. And uh, so now the tablet is factory reset, no of the, none of the old ins information is going to be on there. That was already it for this video. Hope you found the information helpful. If you have any more questions, then please leave a message below.